Should we get started? Ready when you are. Well, we did what we could with the materials at hand. Oh, I love it. It oozes nostalgia. Among other things, you steer, I'll bail. expect Madison or LeChuck's ship to be here by now. Oh my goodness, look at the damage! I've got to go and talk to Carla about organizing earthquake relief. You're not coming to the voodoo shop? Well, of course I want to, but this is a crisis. There'll be other damage. I have to help. Well, I'll want to hear all about it later. Right. Yeah. See you soon. Watch the ship for me. Uh, bite anyone who tries to steal it. You're fine. There aren't any scrap lumber dealers on Melee. Wanted. Any information leading to the arrest and conviction of the person or persons who destroyed the historic mop tree. I'll, uh, keep an eye out for them. <laughs> you saved the cookbook! Yes, I saved the cookbook. The ceiling was collapsing, the building was on fire, people running everywhere, and I saved the cookbook. Cool. You're welcome. <laughs> Are you done with the cookbook? I'd like it back. I don't imagine I'll have much use for it now. <laughs> How come you're still here? The bar is half collapsed and it's slightly on fire. Not done with my drink. Searching for the secret since before you were born! That's exactly my point! Finding the secret is a young pirate's game! Years of experience and me relentless drive will ensure the secret be mine! Only if you don't have a heart attack first! Ha! Last chance to give it up! Then we obliterate you! Get off my ocean! I'm impressed by your crosswind ramming technique. I'll have to add that to my book. My crew is quite skilled when given the right motivation. I am still worried about Threepwood. He shows up in the most unexpected ways. We don't have to worry about Threepwood anymore. I left him broken and near death at the bottom of a cliff. His eye was pussing up and bone was protruding from his leg. Animals have probably already scattered his limbs from one end of the island to the other. So it's agreed. We stop fighting each other and... We join forces to find the secret. Agreed. No funny stuff. We split the secret. Teammates. Nah, it's unreadable now. Though in some ways, that could be considered an improvement. Someone defaced Elaine's scurvy flyer. Am 
I too late? Was LeChuck here? Did Madison come? Did they get it? Where's the secret? Yeah, I'll bet the secret of Monkey Island is in there. It just has to be. You've had it all this time! I possess little and much. To what are you referring? Don't play dumb with me, Karina. I have the map. The secret of Monkey Island is here. What is it you wish to know? Can't you read my mind? No need. I can read your face well enough. The secret is where you suspect it is. Inside the large safe near the front door. Where are the keys to the safe? I'd like to get it open as soon as possible. I am prevented from helping you with the keys. Ah. Uh. But there is one close by who knows much. How do I find him? Her. And she will find you. How do you know that? She is outside the shop. Why did you take the secret? Doesn't it belong on Monkey Island? I have taken nothing. The safe came to me as you see it and belongs to someone else. I accepted a fee and cast a spell upon it to prevent it being moved. That is all. Who owns the safe? Alas, there are forces which prevent me from revealing the true owner. A contract, signed in blood, with gruesome punishments for disclosure. Some kind of a voodoo thing? No. How could you keep this a secret from me? You knew I was looking for it. It is not a secret from you, Guybrush Threepwood. It is a secret. Full stop. I am bound by an agreement. Have LeChuck or Captain Madison been here? No. That's weird. They were way ahead of me. Sometimes it's better to have two enemies than one. But you should not waste time. I might have more questions for you later. I might have answers. But I make no promises. Ah! You found the secret. You are a spark among fallen leaves. Oh, I'm pretty excited. Hold on to that feeling. I am Wideling Bones. Widey. Like you? The hunt for the secret consumes me. Like you, I know where the secret lies, but lack the means to open the safe. You must have many questions. How do I open the safe? Five locks, five keys. Golden keys, hidden long ago. What do the golden keys look like? They're gold. It's just paint, but they look nice. Where can I find the golden keys? Most are found already. Got one myself. Old Mrs. Smith had one before she died, and Bella Fisher too. Also, I heard one was found on Bermuda. That's only four. One more was supposed to be hidden on Terror Island. That one has never been found. Hang on, I'm writing all this down on my to-do list. This doesn't sound so hard. A lot of people don't come back from Terror Island. Also, Bella Fisher sank out at sea and nobody knows where. Took her key with her. Oh. Can I borrow the key you have just to try it out? Not so fast, bright boy. Whitey Bones is not such an easy mark. You prove yourself. Get some skin in the game. Find me when you've got more keys than I do and maybe... I talk partnership. Why is the secret in the safe instead of on Monkey Island? Do you know? Secrets always been in the safe. Uh-huh. How come I never heard about any of this before? I'm kind of a secret of Monkey Island buff. You'd think I'd know about it. The clues were buried deep and clever. Only a few ever puzzled them out. And we keep ourselves to ourselves. You seem more lucid than when you were hanging out of the window on High Street. We all got our good days and our bad ones. If you don't know already, then you'll see. This all seems needlessly complicated. Life is like that sometimes. 
Best just enjoy the ride. See you around, Whitey. I've got keys to track down. Okay, bright boy. But you watch your step. There is a curse. The keys are protected by a terrible curse. Beware. Whoa, a curse? Really? No. I mean, yes, she did say that, but she was just being dramatic. Whitey likes to make a big exit. Well, one thing's for sure. I don't know how to get to either of those islands she mentioned. I'd better get a good sea map right away. Still in business. Hey, Wally. Have you got a sea map of the local area? Can you jot down the locations of Terror Island and Bermuda? No problem. I'll also add a few extras. The ship tracking feature is going to blow your mind. It's a little trick I know. You need to be able to go the extra mile if you want to make it in the big time, like me. Be careful. The last pirates I made a map to Terror Island for were never seen again. And Bermuda can chill you to the bone. Not many pirates want to head up there. Oh, and when you get to Scurvy Island, say hi to Elaine for me. Thanks, Wally. And sorry about blowing you up that one time. Hmm. Hey, Wally. What was the deal with all the crazy maps on Monkey Island? I made the map to the secret, and a darn good one, I might add. But what other people do with it after purchase is not my legal responsibility. Why didn't you tell me the map said the secret was right across the street? That would have saved me a lot of time. Sorry, but I was all NDA'd up on that one. It's great to see you landed on your feet after all these years. Business has been booming with all these new dark magic pirates. Captain Madison has me on a lucrative retainer. She pays extra for a bunch of wacky symbols I just make up. I'll let you get back to cartographing. That's not a real word. Uh-huh. Hi. Great boy. How was your search? See you around, Whitey. Most likely. Welcome to the God's Wallop. Thanks. We feature the freshest fish on the block, and the freshest company as well. Whether you're here to buy or just pass the time, we don't mind. Though, of course, we do prefer it if you make a purchase. Didn't you guys used to be the pirate leaders? It's me, Gabber Streetwood. Ah, I thought when we spotted him skulking around town that he looked passing familiar. The shop seems nice. If by nice you mean a glorious cathedral to the fine art of fishing, then I quite agree. Have a look around, why don't you? I'd like to buy some fish. That's an excellent life decision, me lad. Today we've got hagfish, toadfish, slimehead, bloater, and lump sucker. What'll it be? Hagfish. Here's a box mm. full. Should be plenty. You want me to run a tab for you? Sure. Thanks. Can I trade in my fish for some other ones? Talk to the grizzly gentleman at the counter about that, please. Yeah, it's my shift. Fish? Have you ever heard of someone called Bella Fisher? Bella Fisher? Aye, she could spin a yarn from Port Royal to Trinidad and back again. And a consummate mm. angler she was. B what? Good at fishing. She had a secret fishing spot she did. More bounteous than the whole rest of the sea together. 
She probably rests there now, being as she did disappear on a fishing trip. No one knows the location, though it is rumored that she left a clue as to its whereabouts. Did Bella Fisher ever show you a big fancy key? No, I don't think so. Not to my memory. Just thought I'd check. I think I'll browse today's catch. You'll find none better. Welcome back. Hi there. What's that key? That one is only for going in. Never for coming out. And please, don't touch the glass. What's that lock? It's meant for bachelors to secure their apartments. How much for the fishing lure? It's not for sale. This is a locksmith's shop. Perhaps you saw the sign outside? Hi there. Hi there. These are nice. Thanks. I wonder what they're waiting for. What are y'all waiting for? Earthquake relief. And you'd better not be looking to jump the line. I wouldn't dream of it. Those who cut, get cut. Stan's building collapsed. This place looks like an earthquake hit it. There's a torn picture in here. This half shows Stan himself. It says, Tan's previously owned vessels. So sad. Stan's used to be the best place to buy used chips. Meat Hook's museum is gone. So is the cable to his island. That's just as well, given the worldwide rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle shortage. My brilliant deduction is that the museum is closed. Ahoy! 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 Permission to come aboard. Afraid we can't let you do that. Permission to come aboard, sir. This isn't a protocol issue. Although we do enjoy a good protocol. Are you going to let me talk? Apparently, that's what you enjoy doing. 
There's been a deadly scurvy outbreak on the ship. We're under strict quarantine, so we don't infect others with this deadly pathogen. I don't think scurvy is contagious. You don't know that. My mom's gardener's second cousin's pastry chef says it is. It's a scientific fact. Oh, don't try to snow us with your science quackery. If scurvy wasn't contagious, then only one person would have it. <laughs> Duh. I really don't think scurvy is contagious. You don't know that. My uncle's best friend's wife's dog walker says it is. Peddle your science to someone more gullible. Where'd you get that cool flag with the hole? We found it floating in the ocean. It's Bella Fisher's flag. She probably lost it when her ship went down. We're afraid to take it down and offend the scurvy gods. <sighs> there is no such thing as the scurvy gods. Well, then why is there scurvy? Answer me that! Can I have your flag? Did you not hear me? Scurvy! On board! Quarantine! Well, you could just toss it down to me. Best not to risk it. It's probably crawling with scurvy, trust me. Bye. Don't let the scurvy bite you. Scurvy bites? Oh, I knew this was bad. Won't budge. It's strong magic. I can still get it open with a spell, but I need a good power spot. It beats trying to find the keys. We don't even know where to start. It could take forever. Only a fool would do that. I know an excellent place for power spells, but it's not on this island. No problem. We can craft it there and then come back here. We'll take my ship. I'll stay here to keep an eye on the safe. And steal the secret yourself? I don't think so. Stop it. <laughs> Clearly, no one trusts anyone to stay behind. We'll all go together. What if someone else finds out the thing is here? The only map is lost somewhere on Monkey Island. Probably eaten by a wild boar by now. The map maker knows it's here. I've got a bone to pick with him anyway. I'm thinking maybe one of the large ones in the leg. Ah, Scurvy Island. This is where Elaine's been growing all the limes for the Marley Foundation Scurvy Project. She's probably back here by now. I can't wait to see her. Elaine? Are you decent? Hello? Wait a minute. Hi, I'm working due east of Parrot Rock and due north of the lake today. I pinched a yak with it once, and then I sort of accidentally picked it. obviously means something to Elaine, too. It's nicely dried, and I think I'll fill up my coat pockets with this bulky firewood. It seems like it might come in handy somewhere. Pirates used to have to steal this from Elaine to prove themselves. Now, at least that's what they told me when they made me do it. Wow! Elaine sure has been... I better talk to Elaine before I steal any limes from the foundation she's worked so hard to set up. I was hoping I'd run into you again. I was hoping that too. What happened at the voodoo shop? Did you get the secret? Not yet, but I'm closer than ever. I just have to gather a few golden keys together and I'm good to go. 
That sounds promising. What about LeChuck and Captain Madison? They weren't there, oddly enough. Well, be careful. Can you spare any limes? You can take a few. I'm having trouble giving them away, actually. The project has hit a snag. We have plenty of limes, as you can see. But people are refusing to take them. They say they don't like the taste and they don't believe they'll help with scurvy. As an elected official, I could have issued an edict. But as a private citizen, I have to convince people. I tried this flyer. Yeah, I've read part of this. I know. I, I know it's terribly dry, but the facts are there. What about adding bullet points? They could be little limes. People not liking limes is part of the problem, though. Good point. What if the text was centered instead of left justified? Somehow I don't think that's going to make a lot of difference. Have you tried using a different font? Comic Sans, for example. Yes, but I need a small one to fit all the information on. I'm not sure what to tell you. It's basically a sales and marketing problem, and neither of us is an expert in either of those things. Yeah, I see what you mean. I'll hang on to the flyer. Maybe I can find a sales and marketing expert to look at it. Okay. here. Wally's shop has been ransacked. Wally, can you hear me? Are you okay? I guess he's not here. And he's probably not okay. 